Open the door. Thomas here agreed to talk to me. If you want to see that video, click on my next video and you will see the interview with me and Thomas. but I want to do an update video from last week. We'll see what's going on today. It's always pretty cool to see how the beach gets alive. Cleaning crews here. The guys with the wheat whackers are here. The GIVs are already here. It's a little nippy. Eh? You need a little jacket. Later on, it's going to be hot. It's so early in the morning, but they're going home already. Probably gonna go work. Later on today, this place is gonna be busy. Not busy business-wise, busy with people. And look who's here already. The green machine. Doesn't matter what time it is, the green machine is here. So last video I titled people are living in the bathroom and then people said it's not the bathroom you don't take a bath there it's a restroom are you really taking a rest in there or are you doing your business but I don't know what to call it toilet people sleeping in the toilet they don't sleep in the toilet so I think it's a restroom I can say a restroom and what is really hard to believe last week they opened up the restroom and there was a couple in there a guy, a girl, and they had a bicycle in here. And look how small this place is and how dirty it is on the ground. So they were sitting on the ground. I'm just gonna go in here to show you that there's really not much space in here. So how do two people stay or sleep in here? I have no idea. You can see those restrooms are smaller than the handicapped restrooms. They're way bigger, so 
They had a cart in there, a mattress, a bicycle. Those are a little bit bigger, but still, they probably sleep in here because you can lock it from the inside and you feel safer than laying outside somewhere. Well, that lock doesn't work. See, some of them, they don't even have a lock anymore. This one doesn't have a lock, so the tourists can't even use the bathroom if they have to, so they gotta fix those locks. See, this is one of the handicap stalls. You can actually put something here, a card. And some people had a mattress in here, which is unbelievable because this place is really filthy dirty. I mean, another reason why they're probably in here, they're doing something they're not supposed to do, so, but this is really like claustrophobic in here. And because they spray in here, sometimes the toilet paper is wet too. I had no clue that this was going on, that people were sleeping here because I thought they lock it at night, but they don't. Somebody left their cash register in the fax machine. The whole office is on the beach. They're putting their hazmat suits on. Everybody's meeting right in front of the police station. Lhasa is here. Those are the people that help the homeless to get housing. The city is here. The cleanup crew is here. They all meet here and then they're going to start cleaning up all the way down on rows. See, that's what they basically try to get rid of, those little encampments. They've been here all week, so later on, they're gonna tear that one down. And that's right next to one of those bathrooms. Here they come in again in full force, all the way down to Rose. The green machine. This guy was here last week. Looks like the beach is pretty clean so far. There's not that many people camping out on the grass. Some of them just on the side of the boardwalk. I mean, I don't know if they try to help him. More people sleep here on Rose Avenue. This is basically the end of the Venice boardwalk. It's going to Santa Monica that way. They're probably set up here because they got showers and a sink here. Here they come. Look at all those doors. They got all those dents in here. People knocking on it or I don't know. There must be something with some force in it. Oops. Park Rangers will be cleaning the restrooms. Anyone inside? Oh, yeah. <coughs> Sorry, 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 Sorry. They're cleaning the shower area here. Hey Josh, we gotta get everything cleaned up here. That's what we're gonna be doing here. Nothing in those doors today. We're gonna lock the door in a minute. We gotta clean up the restrooms. Nobody in the restrooms today here. Yeah. Trying to get the guy into a program. He doesn't want to go. It looks like she's helping him out get a place. Sharon Ab, Indian, Native American, Anasazi. This is my reservation. They just told those guys to break it down. I think that's the guy that was living there for three months. No loitering, police enforced. They moved everything, only the couch is here, so they're gonna get rid of that couch. I won't see you forever. Let it be the Jets up in. Right here. I'm out here every day, raw anger involved. I spoke to you many months ago. Many, many months ago. I even went back three days the other night. Shit's giggles. And like, no, part of, part of my mind, the brain of the girl, we can do a series of bikes. Others. Now, do you want to do my night crew? Oh, well, well do you want to hear a prowl first? No, no, no. I need to come on. We're here to try to get. No, no. We're here, what? This, what, what? This? Noodles? 
Advisory, avoid water contact activities near storm drain. There goes the couch. You really have to have patience here. The park rangers don't want to use any force to remove him from that place. So they try to stay calm, talk to him. Because I heard it's not just a misdemeanor and you're not supposed to use any force for a misdemeanor. That's how I understood it. When you guys see like a 15, 20 minute video, it actually takes six, seven hours to film because most of it is just waiting time. Standing here waiting uh, to move to the next location. You see that some of the restrooms were closed when the park ranger knocked on the door. So I guess at night, the ones they're empty, they're gonna lock. The ones they're already locked, they're not gonna lock because somebody's in there. Does that make sense? It's been going on so far for over 30 minutes. So they just called LAPD. I'm not sure if they can remove him or not. No, everybody's moving on. He's staying over there. He picked up some of the food, but they also told him if he needs some more stuff. You can go to the car, they give him some food and some something to drink. So they just asked the guy in the wheelchair if he needs any help, but he said no. They're not making him move, they just make sure that he's okay. To ask him if he needs help. No, he just wants to keep sleeping. He moved everything over already before they came. He's okay. My city park rangers. My city park rangers. Park rangers, anyone inside? Someone inside? Not too many people in the bathroom today. Not a care in the world. He eats it right up. Mm -mm -mm. Off to the next location. One more restroom we'll go to.
Park Ranger, is anyone inside? We're gonna open the door. Hello? Hey Chris. Hey Chris, we gotta clear out. They offer him help every single time, but he refuses to get any help. know him for years already. Well, my friends, that was it. Live here from Venice Beach, California. You see, every day is a different day. You never know what's behind those doors. Today, I just wanted to do an update what's going on here on the beach. Because the last time I was here, I couldn't believe my eyes when I was seeing what's going on in those bathrooms. And a lot of you guys commented on it. You didn't know that was going on. So sometimes I'm doing an update. And uh, if you happen to like this video, give it a thumbs up. Push the notification bell. And subscribe to the GIV. Live here from the restrooms. Not a bathroom. It's a restroom. See you guys later. Tschüssing.